Now, if somebody says, well, I think my car is worth $15,000, what I'll say is, you're right. I don't know where you got your information, but you're exactly right. In fact, you're a little bit low. Now, what's the customer, does the customer expect that kind of response? No. I'll say, look, because most of the time we're going, where'd you get that number? And we want to headbutt them, okay? I'll say, look, if you think your car's worth $15,000, I don't know where you got that information, but, you know, I think you're right. In fact, I think you're a little bit low. We actually think it can be worth $15,750. But the question is, which one of us is going to make it worth that, okay? Because both of those numbers are good numbers, but they are also numbers for a vehicle that has been completely reconditioned and is in top-notch shape. Now, I tell you what, uh, we'll, we'll, do, we'll decide who should do it. Um, it's going to need four tires if you want to get $15,000 for it. Agree? Well, yeah, I guess so. Okay, that's going to be 800 bucks. We can do it for about 700 because we buy tires in bulk. Um, you're going to have to get the uh, 50,000-mile uh, 50, service done. Again, if someone's going to pay you top dollar for your car, and they will, don't get me wrong, because we're hoping they will, but if they, they're going to give you that money, they're going to want to know that the vehicle has had its latest service done. Have you checked into the 50,000-mile service? Yes, no. Uh, you know, let's say it's only 300 bucks. okay? We obviously can do it in-house. We can probably do it for a little bit less. You got dings and dents running up and down both sides, all right? People, people will deduct for that. Um, we have a guy that comes every Tuesday that takes all the dings and dents out of our used car inventory. He normally charges about $200 per side, so in your case, that'd be $400. You see where I'm going with this? Mm -hmm. And you say, look, yeah, you're right. You, 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 whoever told you your car was worth fifteen that could could be was worth fifteen thousand just left out two words could be, because we think it can be too. I mean, we're going to give you thirteen thousand for it, but we're not going to just put it on our lot. We're going to spend money on it, in order for us to get fifteen or fifteen seven fifty. You know, we plan to turn a profit, but we're going to invest in it. Now, the question I've got for you is, I'll stop right here. Well, you'd have to detail. That's a buck fifty. So that's 11, 15, that's 1650, okay? We'll buy it for 13,000. So basically what you're going to have is 14,650 in a vehicle that you're not going to drive anymore in hopes of getting $15,000. And by the way, when you do 13,000 times 7% to one carry the two, um, you're actually going to lose money because you would have missed out on $910 worth of tax credits. Okay, it's crazy. I need your okay right here. Okay, I mean, I mean that's uh, the, 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 people don't know what they're doing when they show up on our lot, and we can't be mad at them. We have to fix them. 